I see there are such a lot of young people in Bosnia and Herzegovina going for change, having dynamics, and do want to have things implemented, including that they look on the uh, requirements of young people to stay here is getting more and more respected. Yeah, it was a great day. We, there were a lot of young people and representatives from civil society organizations here in Bosnia and Herzegovina. And uh, we discussed a wide range of topics revolving around the topic of youth participation. We tackled uh, what are the challenges for civil society and youth associations uh, to really make a difference and to encourage and work towards a more participated society. It was my pleasure to moderate today's event here with the high representative and also representatives of civil society organizations here from across Bosnia and Herzegovina. Uh, there's a lot of knowledge here and we know the problems exist. We know there are many issues and problems, but at the same time, once you bring our representatives of civil society organizations, then you have solutions on the ground. So it was important for me as a moderator to see what kind of local solutions we can apply to some other local communities across the country. And I think we started something meaningful. Uh, the dialogue is always complicated. It takes a lot of time, but on the long term, it, it creates results that are needed for the society. So the one thing that I would like to change uh, in Bosnia and Herzegovina, among many things that there are, uh, would definitely be the educational system uh, because of its division uh, currently. So we have seen that uh, the education can be used uh, as a weapon uh, of, of unifying masses. However, in this case, unfortunately, it is used uh, for the purposes of division. And in such case, uh, many young people, uh, they are uh, in, a, um, in a need uh, for a better and uh, more uh, organized education in order to, um, to shape uh, this country in a more prosper prosperous way. I would change actually many things in Bosnia and Herzegovina, but if I had to focus on only one particular thing, I would say that uh, it's the best option to educate our citizens and to invest more in our education, uh, formal and informal education, in order to have citizens that will actually make change in the future, because uh, only a valuable resource is educated and capable citizens. We all know that initiative is something that pretty much is uh, of the essence when it comes to youth organizations, when it comes to really organizing anything. So if I would really change anything, I wouldn't really say change, I'd say add. I'd say we need more initiative, we need more support for the youngsters, for the young people, such as myself and such as many other people here.